Um, just getting to the Final Four last year, knowing how fun it was and the great experience it was, uh, it gives you, give you that much more motivation to try to get back there again. Um, you, we, we know what it takes to get there, and, um, and it's not an easy road, but it, it's fun. So I, I think us having that experience can help us in a way. Last year, we, we lost five out of our last six games and, you know, went into the tournament. And tournament's a different thing. You know, you can start playing well in one game and all of a sudden you can, you know, get on a roll. Every get the team you play want to beat you in this tournament. So we're just going to go ahead and just play. Like it's our last game, you know, went down to Greensboro. It didn't win the way we wanted. So we, now we just time to read in ourselves because this might be our last basketball career, you know, game in college, so we do, really don't want that to happen, so we're going to play the best we can. We see how everybody attacks a 2-3 zone. You know, there's nobody that we've played this year that hasn't played against a 2-3 zone, so we, we, we see everybody, what they try to do, and um, most people do similar things, but uh, everybody plays against a 2-3 zone. If I was compare so far, I might say Boston College because they got guards that can shoot out from deep, and then they got a, a good inside present with, with a couple of post players. I don't really look at where players play or who they play for. I look at how good players are and well, how good the team is and the coach. And Western Michigan's got a team that can play with anybody in the country. Um, and uh, those two guys, their, their whole team is good. I don't think it's two guys. I think their other guys are really good. I think those two guys, uh, you know, could step in and play any place.